Okay guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna to be showing you the best app on the App Store right now for any musician, okay? It's called Moises, down below, M-O-I-S-E-S, -E okay? It's on the App Store for free, and all it does is basically removes and separates different parts of a track for you. So for example, I could remove the drums from a song, I could remove the vocals from a song. It doesn't only do that, but I will show you everything it does in a second. So. Let's get straight onto it, okay? You should be able to see my phone right now. Um, we're gonna head on to the app, a pretty cool logo with an M, okay? We come straight onto the library. You have to sign up, by the way, with your email, um, but it's pretty easy. So, we come onto the library, we're gonna press add, okay? We're gonna upload a track. So, you can either upload tracks from files, um, or you can import, import it from URL. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna head over to YouTube, okay? And I'm going to get this song, um, which is by my band. I'm going to copy the link, head back, and it should be coming up straight away. Okay, this is quite a cool feature. Um, and then we're basically going to process media. This might take a while, so let's fast forward it here a tiny bit. So it has separated it, okay? We've got the track, uh, Empire of Lights, Chasing Stardust. By the way, this is my band. We are releasing music as we speak. So it comes up to this page now. We've got two track separation, which is just vocals and instruments. And then we've got four track separation, vocals, drums, bass, and sort of the other piano and guitars, ETC. So um, we're going to click on four track separation. Okay, this is completely free at the moment. If you wanted to get five track separation, you would have to get premium, of course. So it's uploading, it's getting the track. And by the way, you can get any track you want. There's no sort, sort of copyright. Um, you can just go on YouTube, pick out anything you want, and it is there for you. Okay, submit, uh, processing files. So let's skip it forward a bit again. Okay, so it, it has processed. We are now ready to download it. So I'm just going to download it, and then we will be able to get straight into the separation. The downloading is done, and we are now going to click onto the track. Okay, so we're straight into the mixer. Not only does this app give you the separations, it also gives you the ability to give a pitch change, okay? So we can put it up a certain amount of semitones. However, you may have to get um, the premium for that. You can also get a smart metronome, okay? So you can change the speed. ETC, either way, that is absolutely brilliant to have on the track. Okay, next, you can also have a stereo control, which basically um, sorts out the audio panning, and it's also very easy to do. Some of these may come with premium, but I know some of them come with the basic free version. Okay, so the track is playing. It shows you the chord structure at the top. Now, this is absolutely brilliant. For anybody trying to learn the song and play whilst they're listening to the track. So, um, how about we try and get rid of the other? So, we've basically got rid of most of the rhythm section, okay? We are literally just hearing the drums and vocals right now. So, let's get the other back in, let's get all the rhythm back in. Guitars, you can see. Okay, so we're hearing everything right now. Let's remove the drums. Being a drummer myself, I know this is great, but any other song, I can just go on there right now, remove the drums and play on top of it, okay? So, let's get the drums back in. If you just wanna hear the drums, put the drums up. Um, if you do not wanna hear the drums, obviously put them down. However, I wanna to listen to what the drums are sounding like, and by doing this, that is what you can have. So, Put the drums up. Obviously, I don't want to be listening to the drums because I recorded them myself. Let's get the vocals back in, the bass back in, and everything else. So you can see how absolutely brilliant this is. On the left here, on the right, sorry, we've got the audio pan in. Um, yeah, it's a great feature to have on this app. So what I want to do now is add a metronome into the background. Okay, so if I want to speed it up, let's speed it up a bit. Okay. Spread it up to 126. Do we want to put it up? 
you can do it either way. Pitch semi toes. You may have to get the premium if you want to do it a certain amount. However, that's perfect for what you need, really. Okay. In the settings, you can export. Then you can play chords. Um, counting. You can have counting. So you can have like a a four um, clip counting. Um, but yeah, that is really it. And you can remove any. You can remove it all. And it's absolutely great for musicians. It's, if you want to cover a song, you can take it to drums. And that's what I've been doing for a while. Okay, so now, if I want to export this into an MP3 or something, I can just hit export mix, and it will export for me, and I will put it to my Dropbox, and then I can use it anywhere I want without the drums, okay? Obviously, right now, I've exported everything, so I'm going to get an MP3, but if I was to do a cover, I would uh, export it with the drums right down, okay? But yeah, this is a great app. It's for free. It's on the App Store. Go and have a look at it before they do start charging you to get it. I know there is a premium on there, like I've said before. And if you want some of um, the features, you will have to pay the premium. It's about £4 a month, and I think it's about £40 a year. So it's not really much if you want to get it. But if you do, it's a great addition to have as a musician. So yeah, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you next week.